Hi guys, it's Nancy here and I'm back with another process video for you. And I'm using a very old piece of paper here. I dug in my stash a bit. This is a 2011 piece of Dear Lizzie. I've loved it. It's a chevron wood grain. It was like when chevron first came out before we all got a little bit bored with chevron. Um, and I absolutely loved it. But I'm trying to use my older stash. And I'm actually mixing this in with a piece of the... Is it the Go Now Go? It was the Chamel travel one. Um, I completely forgot what it's called. Um, and this beautiful piece of paper that's got kind of all travel stamps on. And actually the tines work really well together. So I'm going to be using that for this layout. And I'm also going to put a doily on because I love a doily. I'm using these two older bits from Amy Tangerine. There is a vellum pocket um, and there is a frame. I'm actually going to um, put the vellum pocket behind that frame. Um, that is a camera that um, someone, really bad, can't remember, sent me these gorgeous epoxy stickies. I've used them in quite a few of my travel pages. and um, They sent me two packs. Um, so I'm using them quite sparingly, but I'm using them on stories around photos. As you can see, this is a picture of me taking a picture of my boyfriend, taking a picture of me, taking a picture of him, taking a picture. Um, <laughs> and this is when we were just pulling up to Alcatraz so um, I love the pitch I love pictures like this so I um, love it I pulled out um, the stories um, kit from Ali Edwards which was um, lens was the word um, and of course there was part of that which was a camera theme so I've pulled out one of the four by six cards which says this photo um, and I'm pulling out the stamp set so I'm going to try and use that. I'm also going to try and use um, my stamps from Ali Edwards a bit more. I end up using the Bond kit on here. Or the Bond, yeah, the Bond kit on here as well. Um, so within the lens kit, there was um, these chipboard pieces. And it says ICUC, um, which I thought worked perfect with these photos. Of course, Ali Edwards story kits are meant to, you know, be really deep. And you can look into all of this. But I'm like, no, I'm just going to use it for this. I need to get better at journaling and I see and I love her concept but it just doesn't fit for me I'm I'm very photo driven so I do find it hard um I like to write about what I thought what's in the photos where we were um not necessarily deep philosophical things about lens and how I see life and rah 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 <laughs> but anyway so I'm gonna add a little bit of mist to my background and of course, I am starting with um, Route 66 because, hey, this is the Kitty Scrapper channel. Of course, Route 66 Mist is going to be involved. Um, I really should write to Tattered Angels, I think you made this Mist, and say, hey, this is limited edition. You should bring it back. Um, <laughs> I don't know. It just, I do love it. Um, it goes with everything from Brights to Dowdy to whatever. So I am just bringing my heat gun out because I found my heat gun and it's plugged in. So of course you're going to see it on more layouts. Um, not the heat gun on a layout. I'm not doing a layout about a heat gun. Or, or am I? Um, anyway. So I am just um, using that stripe which is great because you know I am impatient. <laughs> so I'm going to stick these photos down. The Of course I'm a far better photographer because the photo I took of my boyfriend is lighter. Um, maybe something to do with but anyway, I'm not going to go there. But yeah, so I am in the dark a little bit, but that's okay. That's okay, we can see me. Um, so I'm now going to put that um, doily down. It just adds a little bit of grounding. And I said I'm going to put that embell um, bleh, vellum pocket behind that frame. I did contemplate about just putting the vellum pocket um, as is on there, but I thought, no, I like this frame. And again, it's an older piece. Um, which is in a big embellishment um, pot that I've got, which I'm going to try and work my way through because I have like four distinct places that have embellishments and they're all pretty full. So I need to do something about that. Um, so I've just stuck a little wood embellishment there on that frame and I'm putting little poly people on there because it um, symbolises me and my boyfriend. Um, these are some hearts that i um, cut apart from another thing so they were grey and they look sweet so I thought I'd just put them either side to add a little bit of embellishment there so I stuck that epoxy camera down 
and I just love how it looks. I love that little cluster there. It's a little bit old school, but I really like it. Um, so now I'm going to be looking at the stamps and what stamps I could add to help make my title. Um, I really like the idea of stamping titles. I like, you know, I bought stamp sets of alphas thinking, oh, I can stamp these and it will make things really good, but never do. So, and then use one of the stamps that says, um, through the lens I see. Um, and I'm going to talk about um, how my boyfriend helps me document things, especially when we travel together and how that makes me happy. Um, I am, of course, just using archive link here. My ink pads are not very juicy, but um, they work okay. Um, so this is a set from the Bonded collection, the word together. And, of course, that is in the um, Ali Edwards um, handwriting font, um, which I like. And I thought I'd just have that bit of repetition through those um, stamped elements and the words on the card and the pieces on the chipboard. Um, I am pulling out, again, some alphas from the Bella Boulevard sticker sheet. These were the large sticker sheets that had, you can have in the different colours, that had, like, four different fonts on. Um, I am going to play about a little bit here because um, I'm going to put the word documenting, so documenting together, um, as my title. And I'm super pleased that I use that, um, you know, stamp word as part of my title. I'm going to try and do that more. So, um... I'm really super happy how this came out. Um, I am just using some wet glue on these because I do find these little alphas are a little bit tricksy. Um, so I'm just using my wet glue to stick those down. And I said it's a pretty simple layout actually, but it showcases that beautiful Dear Lizzie paper that I love so much. <laughs> um, but also the elements of the um, Ali Edwards story kit. So yeah, I just I just like it. And I'm going to try and use stamps more. Um, if any of you um, followed along with the Chamel's um, prompts in June, she had one about stamps, I think, quite early on in the month. Um, and lots of people said they have loads of stamps and don't use them. Um, and it was around this time I made this layout, so I kind of made that conscious effort to use them. So I'm just going to stick this um, page down. As I said, I'm mounting it up in that um, Chamel paper as well. And as always, I'm just sticking this down so it doesn't go awry. And that is it for this layout. So thank you very much, guys, for watching so, so much. And I'll speak to you all again very, very soon. Bye!